Hello everybody, welcome to game number two of Rebel against Random Boy with his uh, vampires. Before the game he sacked a thrall and bought a vampire. Um, I don't think it was worth sacking the thrall really, to be honest. Uh, he wouldn't have given me anything really good. I guess I could have maybe he's got a wizard, but like as if I'm going to do that in a regular season game. Um... I even put him out of order to try and be sneaky or something, maybe. I don't know. I don't know if he was using rudimentary mind games there. He did buy him the second before he challenged me. Um, but never mind. Uh, I don't care about being 80k, to 80k down. Um, so, yeah, you know, it's. I could put in 20, but I want to save money up for more Beastmen. And. Replacing the Chaos Warriors that will probably die as well, seeing as apparently every time the Chaos Warriors touch, they fucking die. So let's go with a TV disadvantage. Hello and goodbye, random boy. <laughs> um, <laughs> he has got a mighty blow player and a dirty player player, so he'll probably outbash me. <laughs> <laughs> He'll probably outbash the fuck out of me. <laughs> Especially if I roll six fucking doubles goals again. <laughs> oh, it's his stadium. I didn't even check what stadium he had. Oh, kick. He doesn't even have a stadium. Should have checked that, shouldn't I? That was, that was bad not checking that. To be fair. Bad play not checking the stadium. Minus 10 points for Jim. 60, 65th best CCL coach confirmed. Hey, he's got a strength five mighty blow. Fuck off. <laughs> There's no need for that shit, is there? Jesus Christ, what a bad ass. At least that might make him block with vamps. I'll have to activate vamps to block with, which isn't terrible, is it? Not even top 53. Yeah, 65th, isn't it? 65th best in CCLs. So you don't even make playoffs. <laughs> I am in the top one percent. <laughs> yeah, thank you. I'm too new for you. No more advice. Thank you. That is, that is very much. Uh, that is very much uh, a no-no in Rebel. I do definitely do not want anybody to help me. Um, although, of course, the most, the biggest advice you can give is simply exist and hope the dice win you the game. But, um, <laughs> but you know, I'm requesting zero advice. Thank you very much. No advice, anybody. Views expressed in this first of all, are not supported by the <laughs> Rebel Admin Team. <laughs> first of all, I probably wouldn't need it. And <laughs> second of all, it's against the rules. <laughs> 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 
Yes, see, Sabs, I did, I did make a make this, I did make a mistake last game. Yeah, I do. Tactical Kazim, go for the kills. That's acceptable advice, I guess, to to give. But <laughs> no actual real advice, please. <laughs> hey, he did. Oh no, I rolled the one. Oh, I thought I'd wait. We both got one. I got the fame. Oh, he had a cheerleader though. Motherfucker. Mother, he's got five rerolls. Lucky bastard. That's really good, isn't it? Five rerolls for Vamps is much better than four for Chaos. Oh. Exist hard. Yeah, that's the bad thing about putting him over there. I'd kind of rather than the dirty player got mighty blow than the block guarder, but then he had a bit more defense. But of course, he gets cast instantly. Z he's dead. Brilliant. So that should have been the that should have been the dirty player, I guess. Fantastic. Turn one death. Wondrous. Now I wish I'd taken guard, of course, on that instead of mighty blow. Absolutely brilliant. Do you know what I really need is just every hit to be a death. That's that's the best thing about Blood Bowl is when that happens. Yeah, no, it didn't really get the foul much. Oh, no, it wasn't the fucking dirty player. I should have exposed the dirty player. <laughs> didn't get a foul much anyway. Oh, no, it's the guy that's died. Fuck's sake. Fuck's sake, man. I knew I should have put the dirty player on because I just didn't care if the dirty player died. Even though he's defenseless. I'm just not going to care if he dies, am I? There's 30 players on the bench. Interesting strategy. Alright then, let's fucking go! Medimus, Slabimus, Maximus! Push it real good. Ah, oh, there you go. Of course, we get absolutely fuck all. That seems absolutely fucking standard, doesn't it? Superb. Fucking superb. Don't want to foul him with no assists. That seems a great way to get a guy sent off for no effect. Doesn't have frenzy, does he? Herp derp. Base, base, base. This won't fail. I'm on the right. Burp, burp, burp. Yeah, random boy's dice was strong in his first game versus Chunter. He deserved, he deserved to lose <laughs> mightily, <laughs> and just diced, uh, diced the shit out of Chunter really. <laughs> to be honest, absolute dicing. Over and turn two, classic. Classic bashy vamps. Maybe I should have received. Because I haven't got reserves and he's got reserves, so I was never really going to whittle him down by kicking, was I?
Should have just received and maybe hoped to have not got out bashed. <laughs> what a stupid thought. <laughs> but I guess I should have just received and hoped to have not got out bashed. You'd think with a team of fucking strength four guys and claw guys, you should be able to hope for something better than don't get out bashed. But I should have just thought receive and hope for a draw where I don't get too outbashed. Ridiculous. Imagine not getting banged on by Vance. Like, I don't know why I thought I might have not got banged on. I don't know why. I don't know I don't know why I have these bizarre ideas. Like, I thought that Sage wouldn't delete my team. <laughs> you know? <laughs> like, I genuinely believed he would roll something approaching human dice and wouldn't have completely deleted my team. Idiotic. One D on the ball. <laughs> that doesn't really seem worth it, does it? He can assist there though for a two D off him, which is alright. He can two D him. Stan has been great for him so far, he hasn't used it once. Oh fuck, he's uh, he's string for yes, I need misses. That's all right. Punch him into another block. Do I want to block him? Not really. I guess I'd rather not run down here. Don't re-roll this punch, which is inevitably a both down. Yeah, well, tentacles is optional. Well, you can set tentacles as optional, so you can choose whether to use neither or the highest or the lowest, but only one applies if you if you. Based by two technical players. Hello, Dark Walker TD. Uh, yeah, I don't know why. I don't know how it works in Blood Bowl 2. Um, I think on auto it's the highest. But um, I don't bother putting them on manual because I'm pretty much always going to use them. If my opponent wants to dodge away, then I probably don't want him to dodge away, right? <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, it would be highest by D. It does make sense to make it highest by default, doesn't it? But it's not always. Be like if you t if it's on manual, you should be able to choose. Or if it's tabletop, you'd be able to choose. Which I don't know why you would choose to not use the highest because it doesn't make sense. You'd either not use them or use the highest, wouldn't you? <laughs> it doesn't make any sense to use the lower strength. But you know. I'm sure it's an option. I like, technically it's an option. 
No, if tense fails, ah, if tense succeeds, if 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 they fail, they fail their tense roll, their turn ends. Um, yeah, but what I'm saying is incesticide. <laughs> You're never gonna use the lower strength. If you've got a strength four tentacles and a strength five tentacles, you're either not going to use tentacles or you're going to use the strength five one. There's no situation where you'd want to use the strength four tentacles, is there? It doesn't make any sense. It doesn't make any sense that you'd want to do that. Um, there's no need to set dodge to manual, really, for the one in a million chance that you wanted to do fucking manual. No need at all. So again, it's random boy just not bothering to defend the ball here. Um, interesting strategy, probably won't be punished at all, I imagine. I guess we can hope he's punished. But um, probably won't be. <laughs> Maybe I just don't bother. Like, do I even care? That's the question. I can punch this guy. Which is pretty good. <laughs> it's pretty good punching him. If I knock him over... So fucking what? Basically. Ah, fuck it, I'll go for it anyway. Does he dodge to stand next to him to stop him like running in and doing something? One, two, three, four. That was sloppy off me. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. It was awful. <laughs> I mean, it's not what I would have done, but who can say whether it was good or bad? <laughs> Tentacles on the ball, though, isn't there? So it's um, there's a chance. Actually, experience is a bad thing, Adon McKellar. Sam, <laughs> if you actually say that you've got a clue, that that actually, <laughs> brilliant. Then I've got to tell you this quote. Give me a minute. <laughs> this is really uh. This is really fantastic. Um, if you if you like, you know, try to say that your opinion means something. That's actually it's not an invitation to discussion. It actually stifles any opportunity to expand upon those thoughts. There you go. What a look at dog. Did he really get that scatter? Holy shit. <laughs> oh, and he gets the fucking thing as well. Fuck's sake, man. How lucky do you want to be, random boy? Hey, oh, it doesn't matter because he's got the fucking thrall there. Why did he pro it? It doesn't matter. I guess he's not going to He's going to use a team reroll than anything else. Hey, 
roll the double one. Hey, he failed something. Yes. Get fucked in the face. Ah, get off the pitch as well, you prick. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Um. Yeah, he just totally misplayed, didn't he? He went one, two, three, four, five, six. I guess it didn't matter. Failure state, maybe? No, it doesn't make any sense, does it? Brilliant. Right. Now, I'd kind of like somebody to get the ball, wouldn't I? He can punch him. He can't punch him. Disappointing. Unlucky Jim. This is quite nice though, isn't it? No, it's not. It's terrible. <laughs> oh god, I'm so unlucky. <laughs> oh god. Reroll it. Yes. Oh, I thought I was going to cheer my guy out. That was pretty bad. One, two, three, four, five, six, G5. I need romans. I haven't uh, moved my guys up here, have I? That was pretty bad. Oh, killed him! The internet is dead. Boo, region. Boo! GFI pickup is really nice if it works, isn't it? <laughs> Get off my fucking pitch, prick. <laughs> Could just go here. You could also punch him. Get fucked, you no. little cunt! <laughs> Fuck off! GFI. No GFI. Hey, it was a two. Thank you, Camel Mount. Oh, glorious. Yes, I killed the internet because I uh, took some photos of me um, spraying some drink on my boobs and butt. There you go. <laughs> Hello, Tony. <laughs> 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 just 
<laughs> Just, you know, you should have sub- subliminal messages all the way through going, do not play Blood Bowl. Oh, yeah! <laughs> all the time. Oh, oh God. Great. Do not play Blood Bowl. Oh, yeah. <laughs> do not play Blood Bowl. All the, all the way through. <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Maybe I should have done a double G to try and make it a 3 plus 3 plus instead of a 2 plus. Maybe I should have done, yeah. I'm just tagging him. Oh! Because tagging him actually doesn't do anything, does it? It's still a 2 plus away, so I really should have made the second one. I, I remember uh, having a dream that Random Boy failed a, failed a, blood, a, failed, failed a hypnotic gaze once. It was just a dream. Oh yes! Beautiful! Beautiful! My goal for the match was a dead Beautiful. round and that lad was dead for a solid 10 seconds. Oh, oh he's got so Juggernaut! Really not beautiful! Dino. Fuck! Fuck! Shit! Fuck! Cunt! Shit! Fuck! Cunt! Shit! Fuck! Cunt! Ah ha! I should have made the second GFI! The one GFI! The Tagman did nothing! I should have double GFI'd! Fuck, 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 fuck. So at least that was my mistake, wasn't it? As bad as Random Boy played that. Um, as bad as Random Boy played that, I did one GFI that did nothing, and I should have gone for two GFIs. It would have done quite a lot, actually. It would have been a three plus, three plus. I'm too vamp for you. Thank you very much. My hidden goal for the match was a dead vamp, and that lad was dead for a solid ten seconds. Oh, thank you very much. I'm too... New for you. Sorry about that. <laughs> Shit. Shit. Fuck. Shit. Fuck. Shit. Fuck. Shit. Fuck. It's like that GFI just did nothing, did it? It just literally did nothing. He was still a two plus to dodge away. Like it stopped him punching, but he wasn't. He had no interest in punching. He wanted to dodge away and do something. So I should have d tried for the second one. Stupid. Just doing one GFI then. Stupid. Stupid. Oh, my head's, my head's totally on. Don't worry about that. Four turns is all right. He's also only got one reroll. Uh, but obviously I haven't moved any vamps, which is problematic. <laughs> problematic. Yeah, maybe I should have done the GFI pickup, but without having a re-roll, it was just horrible, wasn't it? <sighs> I don't know. He's got sidestep. Ensuite, j'ai du docteur Flu, un voyageur du temps infecté par la pourriture de Nurgle qui se promène dans l'histoire et contamine tout le monde. C'est du bon, mais c'est un peu capillotracté par. That's gonna be fucking hard, isn't it? I guess I've got to blitz him with my e blow. It's 
not advice. No, no, I, you know, I, yeah, it's. Uh, I don't know where they draw the line in Rebel, but yeah, thanks. <laughs> Thank oh, you lucky motherfucker! God, imagine, imagine! Ah! <laughs> God damn it, random boy. Good. So we've got to have a pass plate to score, pretty much. Already. It's it's a funny old game, isn't it? People, people, uh, people love it and hate it at the same time. That's the thing. I know right, Spenny, but uh, I don't really want to invite extra pressure than needs to come on. God, I can't believe he got like a one in nine, then another one in nine, and then it didn't even matter because he just obviously fucking had jugs and just rolled all the dice after it anyway. Thanks, I'm tuning in for you. There you go. JimmyFantastic.com will take you there as well. Right. So we can do a handoff next turn. To somebody there. Means he's going to have to be hittable. Oh, I play on Xbox. Oh, no. <laughs> Is he finally going to use stun firm? Oh, he does. What a great skill. Conclusively proven to be the best skill in the game. Oh, then he doesn't use it. Oh, well, disregard. Put him there. Hard to defend this side now. Like, basically impossible to defend that side. I really don't want to score with a guy who's fully leveled either, do I? 
<laughs> Let's try to score the guy who isn't fully leveled. Skittle still a thing, no idea. A good noob team is Orcs, yeah. Orcs are Dark Elves, yeah, they're both Glorious. No, I won't give in. Until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Glorious Plim Plom Plume. <laughs> Glorious Plim Plom Plume. Also, I tell you what, isn't that brilliant, the... Uh... The way that the notification comes along just above the turn, turn time, right? I think that's brilliant. That, uh, that was by design. Thank you very much, Newt Lung. Newt Lung? Newt Lung? However you want to pronounce it. For staying fantastic for three whole beaver pregnancies and a little bit of a one. Thank you very much. Glorious. Uh, the game's going... Not well. Uh, random boy. Made some mistakes. I couldn't capitalise, so it didn't matter. <laughs> Is uh, the long and short of it? Frustration pile up. Classic. You can't actually hit him on the sideline. At all. Very lazy of random boy this, isn't it? I don't understand what his game is. To. I mean, he can't, he can't punch. He can base, sure, but he can't punch. So these four can only base. I don't know why he kept such a strong thing over there. Don't get it. I'd like to do some punches first, but it doesn't matter. I've got to do the handoff, haven't I? just needed a push and then I could have fucking based these two guys up. Fuck me. Imagine just not getting unlucky. <laughs> just needed a fucking push. <laughs> and then I can tag him. And then I could have even... Um, what could I have done? I could have tagged this character. And I could have gone one, two, three... One, two, three, four, five, six, or something, and try and get in the way. I've just gone five, four, three. I mean, that's really unlikely, isn't it? Proper unlucky. Oh, 
I mean, it was terrible play by him, I maintain, that he had four players that just couldn't reach to do anything. <laughs> and if I had had better dice, I could have freed players up to come down the, the, the fucking field to cover it a bit. <laughs> no Tarsus. Fuck me. Well, I, mean, I know it's win every game, Tarsus. I know that's what I could do with better dice. <laughs> it's just literally win every game, isn't it? <laughs> that's what I can do if I have better dice. I don't think anybody has outplayed me to the point where I couldn't have won if I'd rolled good dice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he did spot it, but if I'd just fucking managed to fucking what not roll a one in nine, I could have put two more guys on those guys, which would have added rolls that he might have rolled a one on, like he just rolled a one on. Oh, calcium. Is he going to foul? Before he gets sent off and then not use him in the second half. That's a that's a decent idea. Foul flat foul. I like that play actually. Oh no, he's doing a gaze before he gets sent off. Oh, okay. I mean I guess that does something. Like not particularly, but I guess it does something. He's strength five, isn't he? Move a guy here, then he goes one, two, three, four, five, six, GFR. Also, he had tentacles. I could have got tentacles on the fucking string four. And okay, he probably would have just, uh, probably would have just succeeded. Oh, he didn't just do a move anyway. Oh, so that's all he could have done then was the gaze. Oh, fair enough then. Pitch break. <laughs> oh, what the? Why does he get the perfect scanner and I get the worst scanner? <laughs> it's unfair. <laughs> get fucked, you little cunt. <laughs> Fuck no. It's not unfair, it's perfectly balanced, as all things should be. Yes! <laughs> Glorious! Oh, random gym! Oh, I love it. Oh, look at the difference between playing well <laughs> and existing and rolling good dice. Brilliant. <laughs> Don't tell anyone, Skuro! Shh! Shh! Don't tell anyone, Skuro! <laughs> Shh! <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh, baby! <laughs> Glorious! <laughs> whoop, whoop! Right, so now he's down as strength guy and a fo his fucking vampire. Oh, yeah! Oh, brilliant. Oh, God! I love Blood Bowl. No, his team's oh, a lot worse. Yeah. I think you've defended that super badly, though. <laughs> I'm not being funny. But having these four guys over there just did nothing, did they? Like, that was really weird by him, I thought. Really weird. 
I don't know what the point was, or like what his idea was or anything. <laughs> Screw oh dear me. He's on 13, let's put him one square further forward. Two squares further forward. <laughs> Done. Oof. Taking the piss, random boy. <laughs> At least I've got eight turns this time. <laughs> oh, mate, I don't take no fucking voids. What do you know about voids? What the fuck, mate? Do you take voids? You seem to know a lot about them, mate. Fuck off. <laughs> fuck off. Ugh. Yeah, exactly. That's 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 exactly my point with kick, though. You just like you very rarely need it because just random kicks happen a very decent amount of the time. Right, so that should be enough to hold the line a little bit. Got to just not get flat flat blocked for free. And I've got to not have this pick up, fail and scatter into the crowd and lose the game. Phew! <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> yeah, honestly, I don't like kick. I, I, again, Skaven's alright because the players you're taking it on are shit, so you're not losing much opportunity cost by taking it. Um, and it's kind of similar with thralls, right? Because the players are a bit shit. And you kind of, honestly, kind of want a short kick with vamps a lot of the time, so that you can put pressure on the ball immediately, like, because their, their, their game is cage breaking, isn't it? So, they're, and they're smooth, they're slow, like, although he, they, see, he hasn't even tried to break through. Now, obviously, I feel like I've played it rather well, not letting him break through, but, um, you know, a, a worse player maybe would have given him you know, a way to break through there, and I didn't give him a way to break through there without being big-headed. Um, <laughs> I think I did. I think I did it all right and stopped him breaking through. You know, like I did all of this around there, so it'd have been pretty difficult for him to break through. Um, but where was I going with that? Apart from just bragging, no, <laughs> I wasn't just trying to brag. Um, but. You know, there was a point, and just imagine I was saying a point. What was the point? Yeah, you re you kind of want it close. The, the weakness of the Vamps is the movement six, isn't it? Like, the team-wide movement six is the uh, disadvantage. So... That's what, you know, it, by, by kicking it short, you're kind of negating that disadvantage a bit. So I quite like the I quite like the short kick as vamps. Like if I was vamps, I would kick it short, 
despite that obviously on when when you're trying to score in turn four you don't really want a deep kick <laughs> like he, he would have kicked it deep on turn four there for sure but um this is kind of all right all these boys around here they're protecting flat fart <laughs> when no one has done verb yeah fair enough Tony yeah I, I don't I like I feel like it's a bit win more you know I, I keep it's kind I feel like it's a bit win more um, basically um, kick like people like it on Skaven because they can completely dominate when they get a when they get a fucking blitz and it's like, well you fucking completely dominate when you get a blitz anyway with Skaven, don't you? Fuck's sake. <laughs> hey! Killed his own dude, lovely. Yeah, Delves, yeah. Is he going for a big foul now? I considered fouling this guy because I was up players. Loving that he's does he know he's fouling Vulvadrill and not <laughs> and not Flapfart. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. No, it's it's fine. It's fine. But um, I feel like kick. You know, I just feel like you you kind of don't need it. It doesn't. I feel like it doesn't really do anything extra. I can get one vamp out of the play at least. Get a 3D in on him, I think, is good. Hoo -hoo -hoo, good job, I did three. Yeah, yeah, like I don't I don't hate I don't hate kick by any means. I just kind of feel like it just doesn't do enough for me to want it. <laughs> a lot of the time, you know? That was a proper gym foul, wasn't it? Sent off for a stun, glorious. Yeah, that's a good idea, I'm too new for you, yeah, that is a good idea. <laughs> it was good on it, T self. Yeah, that's always the best. That's always the best. The instant, the instant two schools out of three. <laughs> Sadly, quite far back. That 
Okay, well. <laughs> giving up a little bit of protection on the ball, but. Get to unleash flat fart. It's like that scene in Gladiator. <laughs> but instead of unleash hell, it's unleash flat fart. <laughs> Flat fart, kill the cunt. What are you playing at? What are you fucking playing at, flat fart? You should kill this motherfucker. Pretty safe, I think, from getting sacked. Winning back this turn was a bit shit, but Vamps are a fucking pain in the ass, so. I don't mind losing the turn of advance to, uh, you know, hopefully cause some damage. Remove a vamp is the biggest thing, because he's still got four vamps, which is, you know, horrible. Completely fucking horrible, he's still got all these vamps. Distraction can effects. He's not. He wasn't a distraction can effects. <laughs> he's just. He's just always put him in the like easiest to blitz positions. Really, that, that's all it is. The other one sidestep, which makes blitzing him with flat fart not not very good, doesn't it? Um, so the edge five one is pretty hard to blitz with flat fart. Could have blitzed him with uh, the strength like the claw mighty beast man, but it's hard to blitz the edge five, dude. Like, you know, most of the time anyway, like he protects him more anyway. Blitzing the rookies, you know, you're kind of knocking over the blodge, stand firm guarder as much anyway. He's just generally just been looser with. Um, he's generally been looser with the uh, stand firm guy, protection wise. That's all. <laughs> Wanker. <laughs> oh dear. Gas. Yeah, they have gas. Cooking with gas, I'm too new for you. As some nerds like to say. <laughs> right. Okay, now it's a terrifying turn. Because all these vamps are going to be active. Can't really defend the ball very well. <laughs> oh, God. Maybe I just blitz this guy.
Oh, no, he's the one doing the blitz. But the Edge is the scariest vamp, isn't it? Of course, I fucking roll over. I need to not double one this. Honestly, like, can I just not get fucked? <laughs> like, yes, I could have blitzed this guy, it's safer. Or I could have blitzed him, I guess I could have blitzed the Stand Firm guy. Okay. But the Edge 5 is so much more dangerous. And I could go one, two, three, four, five and blitz him with Claw Mighty. But of course, I fucking double one. Fuck me. Maybe I should have just blitzed the Stand Firm, dude. I wasn't just ignoring him because <laughs> because he was the stand firm guy. I should I guess I should have just guaranteed getting the hit in, shouldn't I? But it was a good opportunity to hit the Ad five. I really haven't had the chance to hit the, the Ad five that much. Because flat fart can't hit him. Unless random boys got like no players left. No, it isn't a done. Honestly, I've I've been wanting to hit the edge five. I nearly hit him the other turn as well. Just with a claw mate. It is his only guard. It's like it's quite a good player to get rid of as well. Not just because he's got stand firm. The stand firm is an incidental part of him. I'm not really looking at the stand firm when I'm looking at that player. <laughs> I'll be honest. He's a blodge guard vampire. But the other one is blodge step edge five. And he's a fucking terror, isn't he? Like, I really want to get, get him out if I can. Yeah, I was, I was, I thought, I mean, I did as much as I could to stop the big play. Like, I don't know how likely the big play was, but I mean, I tried to stop it, didn't I? Oh, you motherfucker! <laughs> stop it! <laughs> Kind of wanted to push there, didn't I? One, two, three, four, five, six. I mean, I could hit either one. Ces joueurs sont tout proches. Le combat paraît inévitable. Two, three, four, five, six. I think I want to hit him. Ah, the sidesteps are mine. I'd rather hit him from there. The cards, I've got to hit him. Which means he's got to go there. Oh, I'm 
Man nous ramène où, Bob Pas pour ça. Il faut se rapprocher jusqu'à sentir la laine de l'adversaire et voir les insectes coller entre ses dents. Oh, fuck off. Man, if only I'd removed the Edge 5. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> if only I'd removed the Edge 5. No, I wouldn't have cared about pushing him. I've never cared about pushing the, the, the stun firm guy. But yeah, I mean, I would have pushed him a lot, I guess. But I've never cared. He hasn't even used stun firm a lot of the time, has he? <laughs> grab, yeah, grab. Grab's not bad as a late skill, honestly. God, I really, really would have liked to have got rid of the the edge five, but I didn't want him to sidestep like forward because then he could have hit this guy and everything bad could have happened. At least I've taken away his guarder, so I don't have to think about guard in future. Uh, yeah, there's no cooking sim on the YouTube's. No, it was just on just on Twitch. Probably should have put it on YouTube. Some of the funniest moments, I guess. But hard to know when they were, isn't it? He's down at eight players. Got three men up this drive, but um, two more vamps. Even the rookie vamp can can gaze, can't he? He can roll dice with a rookie vamp. This is the big one, obviously, this is the one I really want to get rid of now. Trump. <laughs> Trump's the, the terror. Trump is the terror. That's fine, I'm using two players to knock over a, a shitlord. <laughs> no offence, Vulva Drill. <laughs> Absolute shitlord. <laughs> <laughs> it kind of is, but I'm stuck on the sideline and I haven't really advanced. And he's getting to punch him down. Like, he's doing pretty well, and he's still got the active vamps, that's the annoying thing. Like, if he didn't have the Edge 5 vamp. Things would be a lot better, wouldn't they? <laughs> hey. Hey, that was a good that was a good dodge to either fail the tense or fail the dodge on. I kind of need a power on this guy, don't I? But if I power him, I can buzz, bust through here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Mm. GFI, not really. I've got flat fart to do it, but then that means I've got to commit the furthest forward dude. I guess that's okay. So he can go there. And put a tentacles guy on him. Herp, derp, 
base, base, base. This won't fail. I'm on the right. Burr, burr, burr. <sighs> Never fucking lucky, man. Maybe I should have rerolled. But with only one reroll, I didn't want to. I just thought I'll get a removal, you know. Hope for, hope for a removal. But will I fuck get a removal? Fuck me. Fuck's sake, man. God, I wish I had a reroll for that blitz. <laughs> oh, shit. I mean, I had a reroll, but I, I, you know, I felt like I wanted the reroll in the last turn. At least I'm not losing, probably. <laughs> I guess this guy could still win it for him. Technically. Yeah, probably not gonna lose. But a bit frustrating not to win. I guess maybe I shouldn't have pushed it hard down the sideline earlier. Because it did let him box me in with that. The fact that he, fit, he managed to make the dodge and then uh, not get removed, like fail the, like make the tentacles roll, then not get removed, and then obviously they're both down and not get removed. Like both pretty, I could have salvaged it with the dice that I had, couldn't I, without having, I didn't have to re-roll, the, like, the, the both down might have been good enough if I'd removed him. But, uh, rough. <laughs> yeah, not going to move I mean, remove three, that should, that, you know, that's about all you can ask for, isn't it? Uh, removed one quality player in the drive. Um, obviously, I would like to have removed more. But I guess I didn't. I guess I just should have played it better, right? Shouldn't have been in that situation of being so stuck at the sideline. I guess. Yeah, that was pretty. That was pretty unlucky having the guard die on turn fucking one, wasn't it? Because I could have apoed him. As it as it turns out, probably I could have apoed that guy, and he might have lived. I can keep him with strength too, potentially. At the end of the day, it's rough, but uh, you know, it, it, he's he's a body, isn't he, to put on the LOS against the fucking two thousand four hundred Nurgle, etc. Of course, he gets the power to free up the fucking van. I I did think about putting the the DP in there just to keep. You know, just to stop that 1D happening. Maybe I should have done. But I didn't like that he could move these guys around as well. It's 
long as it's not a armor break, it's not that bad, is it? Well, I'm provided he doesn't get the ball. <laughs> That's an armor break. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Tentacles. Might do something. Tackle might do something. Yeah, good scatter at least. Wow, he just punches. Doesn't go for the uh, doesn't go for the attempt to score. I guess this makes his uh, his defending easier. Alright, so I dodge blitz, I guess. <laughs> dodge blitz. Punch and then 3 plus 3 plus 2 plus 2 plus. I don't see anything better than that. Um, can I do a chain? Oh, maybe I could chain him to there. One, two, three, four, five, six. GFI, GFI is only marginally better, and I would need a power as well, but I would have two chances to power him. But then to set that up, I'd have to make another dice roll anyway to free up flat for that. Which would be a 2D without block. This probably comes out as a wash anyway. Oh, I need to fill in this square as well, so it's really hard. Okay. The dodge blitz, I think. Rather scoring him really, wouldn't I? Get close at the claw. Um. <laughs> Could go for a greedy block on his other vamp for like no real reason. Um. Adds a 1 in 36, might get SPP on a guy who's a legend, so kind of pointless. Really pointless. Let's go for the pickup handoff. Didn't need your hands, glorious. Oh fuck. Oh god, there's a chance, there's a chance! Ah, oh, you can't. That's kind of fair, I guess. I was pretty lucky to score the first half, I guess. Maybe I should have put the, the dirty player there as well, that would have stopped that hit, which meant I would have only had to do the 3 plus handoff and the 2 GFIs. Which maybe would have worked. I mean, it probably wouldn't have done, but... You know, could have played better. Always. Always could have played better, so... Kind of robbed of a win, kind of. I mean, only kind of. He had to roll some dice to score, I rolled some good dice to score the first half, so. It would have felt a lot fairer failing to score in the first half, but making that score in the second half. <laughs> but even then, I, I played bad that drive to get in a bad situation, he played well anyway, so. Either way, it was. It was kind of play's fault that I had to roll dice to score in the end, wasn't it? It wasn't just done dice. So, fair play to random boy. 23. Oh, you got the MVP anyway, that's alright, he gets block. 23 AV breaks. Only just out blocked him. Very annoying to take the death on turn 1. Because if it happened later, I would have appoed it. But I didn't really want to app it on turn 1. Oh god, <laughs> the GFI is 7 out of 12. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh god. 31, 36, 24. So pretty terrible block, guys, actually. Pretty terrible block, guys. Thirty-two, thirty-one, twenty-four. Pretty terrible block dice for him as well. So yeah, it's not bad, is it? It's, I mean, undefeated, winning a draw. That's all right. <laughs> it was random, boy. Yeah, you carried on. You you picked up where you left off against Chunter, didn't you? <laughs> uh, yeah, well played, I guess. Second half. I mean, I don't know if if you played well or I played bad. Second half. Um, I guess me not scoring on that drive was fair. Well, no, I think me not scoring on the drive on turn four was fairer, but I don't know. The first half, like the four turn score, not scoring was probably fairer, but I don't know. I, I, I should have not had to roll dice there. I should have played better, somehow. I feel like I should have played better in the seven preceding turns. To have not had to roll those dice. Um, right, 70k means I can buy another beast man, so that's nice, isn't it? That's nice. So bad getting him killed on the first block. Well, not killed. You can still keep him. Like, he genuinely might have to keep a fucking strength 2 player <laughs> against somebody. Next up's Wolfbark. Oh, God, he's got a claw upon her. He's got a, he's got a claw pommer, so he'll probably get out bash that game as well. Right, never mind. But kind nearly top of the league, not bad. Right. Um. Yeah, exactly. He's still a guard guy, and he's you know obviously strength two is awful, but people will forget he's strength two and use an assist anyway. And a lot of the time they can get an assist, so strength two isn't being that bad really. It just comes that bad when he's blocking, and yeah, he can take hits on on the LOS and take hits on late in halves and stuff, so I, it's stupid not wanting to sack a strength 2 player. But at the end of the day, he's a body, isn't he? You know, if there's a difference between 13 men and 12 men, I'm, I'm going to keep him. Um, right, so there you go. Well played, random boy. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.